Please help support the work by liking, following, sharing, and subscribing. Thanks. Just for today, June 10th, changing motives. When we finally get our own selfish motives out of the way, we begin to find a peace that we never imagined possible. Basic text, page 45. As we examine our beliefs, our actions, and our motives in recovery, we'll find that sometimes we do things for the wrong reasons. In our early recovery, we may have spent a great deal of money and time on people, wanting only for them to like us. Later on, we may find that we still spend money on people, but our motives have changed. We do it because we like them, or perhaps we used to get romantically involved because we felt hollow inside and were seeking fulfillment through another person. Now, our reasons for romantic involvement are based in a desire to share our already rewarding lives with an equal partner. Maybe we used to work the steps because we were afraid we'd relapse if we didn't. Today, we work the steps because we want to grow spiritually. We have a new purpose in life today, and our changing motives reflect that. We have so much more to offer than our neediness and insecurities. We have developed a wholesomeness of spirit and a peace of mind that moves our recovery into a new realm. We extend our love and share our recovery with complete generosity. And the difference we make is the legacy we leave to those who have yet to join us. Just for today, in recovery, my motives have changed. I want to do things for the right reason, not just for my personal benefit. Today, I will examine my motives. Just for today, June 10th.